All right, so real quick tutorial today. Uh, what we're going to talk about is how to load the film magazine in a Hasselblad H system. So this happens to be an H1, but of course this will work with an H2 um, or whatever, as long as you have the HM1632 back. Um, so step one is real simple. We're just going to take this lever. I've already got it turned by mistake. Oops, no, I don't. Um, so we're just going to lift up this lever, and we're going to rotate it and take out the film magazine. Now I'm going to set the camera aside. So this is set up just like you would find it when you've run out of film. So you would take your shot roll here out and package that away. And then the second step is real simple. So see this bobbin here? This needs to be taken out and you just move it to the side because this little lever here shifts. And now you roll it over to the other side. So now it's on the uptake side, and you can tell the uptake side because it's the one with this icon. And you can see how the arrow says that it's feeding onto the roll. So this goes on the uptake side. Real simple, we're just going to catch it on that little metal lever right there, and then push it out of the way, and drop it onto the other bobbin uh, spool here. And then it's not engaged yet, so we're just going to roll it. Now you can see it's seated completely. Step three take your new shot roll or your your new roll ready to be shot and a lot of people will tell you to break this seal before you put it into the magazine I don't think that's the best way because then you have a piece of paper hanging off the side you also have to concentrate on not unrolling it by accident if you were to drop it then now the film is ruined because it'll unwind so what I like to do is just to go ahead and Snap this in, you can see again, it's not quite seated right, so I'm just gonna play with it until it's seated. Now that it's in, I'll go ahead and break this paper seal. I'm just using my thumbnail, hopefully you can see that. And it's broken. So what I'm gonna do is not worry about that paper seal, we're just gonna rotate this in the hand until you reach the other side, and then pull out two or three inches. Now, I'm gonna turn it over and hold it in my hand like a hamburger. Or a sandwich right actually I'm going to turn this upside down and hold it like a hamburger or a sandwich and here I'm looking for the the opening in the bobbin right there in the spool and I'll go ahead and peel off this piece of paper and set that aside I'll unfold the tail and then we're simply going to tuck it in now, because the way I'm holding it, this isn't going to unwind on me. It's secure, so there's no risk of ruining the film. Now that I have it tucked in to the spool, we'll go ahead and give this just a little turn. And it's come back around, and I'm going to push that down so it seats and turn. And now it's caught and wound on itself so it won't unwind. And it's tightened up. Now I'm just going to roll on a little bit more until I can't see white. And that's it. Now for this film, it's barcoded, and the Hasselblad will pick up those barcodes and wind the film until the start position. So a lot of other people will tell you to wind out this side until you can see the start arrow and that it aligns with this little indent. You can do that, it won't do any harm, but you don't have to because again, the Hasselblad will pick up on the barcodes and knows ex will know exactly how far to wind it. So this is loaded and ready to go at this point. Um, put it back in the camera we'll just drop it into its home all the way make sure to press down because it is spring-loaded and turn it and lock it um, this little lever always goes on the right that'll save you from accidentally putting it in there the wrong way and that is how you reload a Hasselblad the easy way if you have any questions or comments leave them down below I do respond to comments pretty quickly um, of course, you can find my work online at hunterphotographic.com. Um, make sure to like and subscribe. I'll have more of these videos coming soon. Take care.